The Patals. The Patals came from another universe, a neighboring universe next to ours in this multiverse. They look like the Kaminoans from Star Wars. Their civilization is very advanced. I see oval-shaped and round-shaped architectures and towers, and around is full of trees and grasses. They really synchronize with technology and nature with great harmony. As you know, technology is the more logical and masculine side. Nature is more of the feminine and creative side. They really synchronize them very well. The Patals, I feel, have no genders, biologically, and they are fully balanced with their masculine and feminine. They are very logical and practical thinkers, preferring to work with technology a lot and programming, science. But at the same time, they are very creative and gentle. They are soft speakers, and their tone is really gentle. I feel extremely comfortable speaking with them when I was channeling them for the first time. The Patals are powerful light workers and grid workers. They use powerful technologies to stabilize the surrounding energies and environment. They have helped build and revive a lot of the stabilizer in our universe. These stabilizers operate in a higher dimension to prevent any lower energies from corrupting and entering the higher dimensions, which is 5D and beyond. Another technology I see is their towers, and they are aligned with the exact location or with the lightning bolts from the sky. And with that, they can channel into many different profound technological uses and energy source, many different energy sources. They also have the technology to create dimensions similar to the Andromedans. If you've seen my、uh, Star Seed Origin about the Andromedans, which was pretty old, by the way, a pretty old video, in one of their in the description, so I see in one of their dimensions. This is in the Patals, by the way, but very similar to the Andromedans. I went through a portal and I saw a beautiful garden and a forest. That's why they are very close with the Andromedans. It's like many portals to many different worlds, almost like a video game, a fantasy world, open world video game. The High Council of the Patals are also world creators and are able to create as many dimensions or worlds as they want. As long as it can harmonize and stabilize with other world without any friction, the problem, however, is the other universe, the neighboring universe, which is our universe, has energetically affected them, which caused a huge imbalance in the force. I'm joking. <laughs> well, I mean, similar in the force, but a huge imba- imbalance in the energy frequencies and. Also, a lot of corruption too, but yeah. So these imbalance corrupts their universe if they don't come here and fix ours. So it's like virus. If our universe is corrupt, it jumps to the other, right? If you've seen my previous video, I explain it in the multiverse video. They saw a huge rift in our universe, like a crack. It's like a crack in the program or corruption. This is true, as this universe is literally like a video game, and a simulation. So imagine there is a virus affection in this universe, and so it's something. It's something like that. They saw a crack, and so they enter through that crack, that rift, to our universe. Right now, they are traveling in spaceships, working with. The Galactic Council of Light, of Light, or the Galactic Federation of Light (GFL). So, same thing. I saw a dimensional rift somewhere in space, and they enter through the rift as our universe was affecting theirs. So, currently there is a huge rift or crack crack in our universe, but a lot of them are being fixed right now. 
So we are in actually we are in great progress and advancement. And these are caused by corruption such as the archons, or what they call the cosmic parasites or cosmic viruses. It's like a program, right? So the these tears apart space and time, these cracks and dimensions, which causes a huge vulnerability in our universe, casually allowing alien energies to enter. Energies that are not for the highest good. Energies that are not for the highest light. Not only that, these cosmic parasites corrupt energies, any energies. By energy, it can be anything: our bodies, our mind, our soul, our planets, our moon, our solar system, and the list goes on. The demiurge, known as the creator of our universe, is actually, in fact. A cosmic parasite that corrupts our entire universe. Currently, it is operating on the fourth dimension and below, as the grid is perfect and we have trapped it below. It will not affect higher dimension, and therefore, it is essential for all the 3D beings to ascend and allow the light to be integrated into us. Choose unconditional love. Over any negative emotions, get rid of the ego, as this is part of the demiurge matrix. Live life with the flow, and whatever you set the intention to do, do it from the heart of love and perseverance. Think of the higher dimensions, 5D, 6D, 7D, and so on, like a system update. The updated system, which are the higher dimensions. Are free from any negativity and malice. It is also a higher timeline, but it is up to us whether we accept that system update, upgrade, or not. Some of us may choose to stay low and not accept any form of upgrades as they stay in the lower timelines, and some may wander in the middle, unwilling to choose either side. Undergoing these upgrades may not be an easy task at first. You must be willing to let go of the old energies and make room for the new. You must go through a full detox to cleanse all the old energies and then implement the new ones. There will be struggles to go back to your old life, that habitual struggle, but you must. Simply let go of all these thoughts. The Andromedans are here to help us release our subconscious that have been stuck for so long. They are very specialized with the subconscious mind and dreams. Their technology with dreams are very advanced. You can always seek for their help. We are currently here in this universe, the Patals, to fix. The grid and monitor them to make sure they are impenetrable from anything. We are sending blue ray energies into any part of this universe that needs to heal and amend to the broken. The ancient technologies that have been destroyed and left into ruins, ancient ancient stone circles, temples, esoteric structures of different types. Many of these technology contain lost knowledge and magic, and the power to bring stability and harmony for the universe all together. We are here to restore them for the highest good of our unity consciousness. Always strive to bring unity with every intention. We will be staying here and working with beings of this universe. Until the day where your universe can fully ascend and be brought back to the light, we are sending you much love, and we have absolute faith in each and every one of you. Know that if you stumble, always look back at the light. The light, the happy place, is always within your soul. That reminder alone will be powerful enough to lift you back. Remember the golden, golden timelines. Be optimistic. Thank you. This was the message from the Patals. 
If you like the video, please like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I'll see you again on my next video. Much love and peace.